Now, if we talk about the third part, that is the attack part. So there may be situations where something can be damaged or otherwise compromised information or so some systems can be uh, which can be attacked, which possibly can happen through active mode or passive mode, maybe intentionally or unintentionally. It may be direct or indirect as well. When someone casually uh, reading the sensitive information, which is not intended for his use for his or her use, possibly we can say that is a passive attack. But if, if the hacker attempting to break into a system, that is intentional attack. Sometimes it may show that, like if, you know, the lightning which strikes a uh, causes fire to a building, that is definitely an unintentional attack. Just for uh, giving an analogy. A direct attack is a hacker using a personal computer to break into a system. That is a direct attack. Indirect attack, like a hacker compromising a system and using that to attack other systems. For example, like part of a botnet. So there, uh, that can be treated as an indirect attack. But in, uh, again, that is also equally vulnerable. 